What if I tell you I can replicate any NADN workflow in just one click? So for example, here I provided a screenshot of the simple agent and then I received the JSON code. And now what I can do, I can copy that, go over to NADN and here just paste it. And afterwards, just look, we've got the sticky notes with the explanation and what is even better? We've got everything set up. So here, for example, you know, the code snippet there, um, like all of the steps are set up. And by this way, you can just copy and paste any workflow you want. So in this video, I will show you step-by-step -step how you can set up this cloud project that actually will scrape for you any NADN template. And here also, we've got a lot of instructions. There are the files and everything you can find inside our 100% free community. Um, here you go over to YouTube resources and there you've got to replicate any NADN workflow. Um, so we'll be using this project instructions. We'll be using all of these files. And by this way, you can again um, do everything. For an example, I can type create for me a simple AI agent um, in NADN return um, that in JSON format. So after I run it, I will get the code in JSON format and I can just copy and paste that inside NADN. It's so, so powerful. So now let's wait a while because it's being generated. So after it's done, you can see we've got simple AI agent workflow. And here in the right top corner, we can just copy the code. And now afterwards, we can just paste it inside. And now look on that, we've got even sticky notes. We need to organize them. However, still it's so, so useful. We've got here the AI agent. I'm here the model, right? Everything that we want. So in this video, again, I will show you how to do the step-by-step -step so how you can create effortlessly um, templates inside NADN. Okay, so in general, what we'll be doing? We'll be using Cloud, which is a powerful large language model to create project and inside the project, we'll have the specific instructions and specific files that exactly indicate what we would like to do actually with this project. And yeah, we would like to create the JSON format and files to um, paste inside NADN. So inside, um, actually how we can do this. Um, you can go over to main page of um, cloud and here click on the project. I'm um, actually need to have the subscription and now you can click on new project. And now you can name it as NADN, let's say test uh, project. Uh, we can name it as, um, okay, we can name it as NADN test project. We can create the project and in general, we need to provide here some instructions and files. I prepared for you inside our 100% free community. So we can join, actually we have a lot of content, a lot of users. You can join Open Classroom, YouTube resources, and now click on re replicate and NADN workflow. And here um, we've got the project instructions. So very simply, role overview. So you are a professional NADN workflow builder. Your responsibility is to deliver complete, fully working NADN workflow JSON files. Um, there we've got other, for an example, your tasks, I'm um, here, generate only valid import ready JSON files. Do not include any explanation, screenshots, or formatting. Um, use any provided reference materials such as um, example JSON files, and I then cheat sheets, and a lot of more. So overall, uh, you can just copy that from our community. Um, copy the entire instructions. Um, let's go over here. Set project instructions, and boom, just paste it here. And yeah. Like you can modify them, do everything you want. However, they are very complete and you've got everything here. Um, so you can just save the instructions. However, this is not everything because when you go over to our community, you've got actually six documents, actually files to download. Uh, one to three documents. So in general inside, we explain how it should behave. So the entire project, how to create JSON files. And we exactly explain that inside these documents. These are necessary because otherwise um, you may get a lot of problems. So you just you just simply click here and um, you download them. And also what I like to do is to add some sample JSON. Um, yeah, so sample JSON files with specific automations that are already created. So for example, I've got a storage generator, Telegram chatbot, and again, I upload everything inside here. So let me show you um, other projects. So here we've got an IDEN workflow builder. I have all of the files right there. And that's pretty it. Afterwards, what we can do, let's go over to some NADN workflow. So for an example, I have this onboarding system. Let me make a screenshot of that and go over head to cloud and just type replicate for me and um, this um, yeah, workflow, 
workflow, um, return the response in JSON format. JSON format, that's correct. Let's run it. And by this way, you can replicate actually any workflow. Um, some exceptions are very sophisticated workflows automations. So there you may have some problems. However, you will look, um, yeah. After you create it, you, you can see how it works. So let's wait. So let's wait until this code is uh, finished. So it's creating for us the entire JSON code. And actually, that's amazing. You can go over and take the screenshot of any automation. Just paste it inside cloud, and it will return for you this JSON code. You can just simply copy paste inside and then and get the entire workflow set up. It's so so nice. So right now I have the entire code created. Let's go over there. Just copy it and go over, for example, here. And now I will paste it below. So let's see. All right, we've got it. It's a little messy. However, everything is at the point. So we've got the form trigger here. I'm the note for that. And now look how it goes. Um, so let's paste it here, organize it a little bit. And that's perfect. Just look here. Actually, even there we've got an error because it should be actually connected. And there we've got everything kind of the same. It's literally the same. So we've got all of the steps, even we've got sticky notes. Um, it's really cool. Even we've got everything set up right there. Uh, just perfect. And actually, by this way, you can take any template you want, actually create, um, actually set it up. Let's maybe take something else, something more complicated. And now I've got LinkedIn Post Generator. So let's make a screenshot. Um, yeah, and now let's go over here and paste it. And now, um, again, I can go over and type. Now for that, uh, let's run it and see what we get. And now what we can do, we can go over here, copy the code, go over there and just paste it and see how it performs. So it's messy. However, after we, uh, yeah, after we um, organize that, you will see everything works. So as you can see, we've got all of the automation set up. The only problem is it didn't provide a note for the LinkedIn, so we need to do it manually. However, everything is the same. So we've got three AA agents here, HTTP request, we've got our Gmail on form submission. So again, um, actually even look, we've got um, the content. So again, we can actually go over to cloud, paste any screenshot of the automation and afterwards just get the template, copy and paste that. And even it's better than manually doing that. So maybe let's say you've got some complicated workflow and for sure, sometimes we've got the problems, obviously. However, you can take this workflow, take a screenshot and just paste it to cloud. It will generate for you the JSON code and then just um, yeah, paste the entire workflow here, make some adjustments and still you save a lot of a lot of time. So for me, this is so, so cool. Actually go over to our free community and copy all of the files provide, uh, provided in the project. For now, this is everything. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I will see you in the next material.